Hey guys, it's Icy Near, and we're here with more uh, Better Than Starting Mans. And I've built a new uh, ship. I'm going to change out the crew so I don't forget. And then uh, we'll talk about it real quick. Basically, uh, this is an experiment. I'm hoping to at least get science over the ocean. If not get into orbit, I don't think it's going to get into orbit. We're going to give it a shot. Basically, four liquid fuel tanks connected um i have another engine here I actually wanted to switch this engine real quick actually we're gonna go with the engine that's more efficient in air or in the atmosphere uh fuel tank um rcs fuel rcs rockets i don't have an sas in this because i think that the rcs in here is going to be enough and then a load of batteries uh not positive about the batteries whether it's too many or too little but I'm hoping it'll uh, at least get a transmission off. And then a parachute, obviously, because I want to bring this guy down. Um, and of course, it's Jeb. Why does it always go to Jeb? Whatever. Jeb, deal with it. So what I wanted to do was turn off electric charge from the actual pod itself. Um, okay. That is not a good sign. Um... It's not a good sign. What I wanted to do is turn off electric charge here. And I'll explain that in a second. So, there we go. Okay, so I probably should... Uh, we're going to do this one more time. I, I can do this. I forgot to throttle up before I released. Okay, so throttle up. Turn off the electric charge. RCS, SAS. Launch. Okay, much better. The reason I'm turning off the electric charge here is um there's a bug in vanilla Kerbal space program where it uses from the crew the pod first and that will kill my people if i transmit well well without turning that off because it'll use up all the energy the life support will fail even though there's more charge left over so i just wanted to make sure i remembered to do that um and yeah this is pretty much a matter of just use these to go up as high as i can we're carrying a lot of weight, but we're still getting decent lift. I don't know. We'll see how this works. Uh, okay, I just want to make sure I didn't put the parachute in the wrong one. I still don't know what this does. Like that one right there? No clue what that symbol actually means. But uh, we're getting pretty high. This is actually decent. I feel like we probably won't be able to get into orbit with this thing. Like, almost guaranteed we're not getting into orbit. But we should get high enough that we can at least do some science. Ooh. I'm screwing everything up. Okay, so that went badly, and that was a failure in launch. So let's try this again. Okay. Wow, we bumped the... Okay, we're going to try one more time. We bumped the stabilizers as we went up. Okay, let's try this again. We got to wait till we settle down a little because we're wiggly. We're settled. Let's go. Wow. Okay, so let's go ahead and put some uh, fins on this thing. I or winglets on this. I am having a lot more trouble keeping this straight up than I thought I would. So we're going to put the winglets. There we go. Oh crap, that's on. Hmm. Let's put the winglets here. I don't know if that's going to help. We're going to try it. We're going to see. I feel like that's not going to help. I feel like that's going to destabilize us. Okay, throttling up. And launch. Oh my god, that's much better. That is much, much better. Perfect. Perfect. 
We're going up a bit slower than before because of the added weight of the winglets, but it's keeping us going the right direction at least. Okay. So basically, I'm hoping to at least get science over the ocean, like a um, crew report. Oh, I should turn this off before I forget. We just want to save that energy. We have to remember to turn it on before we separate this stage out, though. Because all my batteries are in this stage. So before we hit this decouple, we have to remember to turn that back on. Or my man is dead. Yeah, this is going to bring us... Ah, that extra weight is killer. What are we going to get up to? 12, 13, 14, 15-ish before we run out of fuel on this stage. Okay. Next stage. And what do we have? Let's go ahead and bring that up, please. 37 so far. Almost overheated that engine. Because I wasn't paying attention. I wish there was a way to see that on your map. Like the overheating, I'd love to be able to see that. 58, so now what we're gonna do is bring this around here a little bit, start angling. I really don't see myself being able to actually orbit here but um, we'll see what we can make happen. We should at least be able to get a, we can at least get a crew report over the ocean. Okay. That's a wonky tonk orbit we got going. How high are we now? 70? Cool. Now we can start playing the, uh... Actually, let's go ahead and grab a crew report right now. Above the shore? Perfect. Oh, wait, I wanted to transmit that. Crew report. Transmit. We have to just keep an eye on our electric charge and how much that uh, drains. There we go. We're going to run out of liquid fuel here. So let's chill it all down. So we're not going to get over the ocean because I, like, turned the wrong way completely. But, um... Oh, actually, we can only get about one more crew report. If that, we'll be able to get one for the way down, at least. That we can bring home with us. Oh, maybe. We're running pretty low on electricity here. Please don't run out. Oh, crap. I meant to go a little farther. Okay, well, we're out of fuel now. Now it's just a matter of, is this going to finish uploading before I run out of electricity? Oh, God. Oh, God, he died. Mistakes were made. I had... A lot of electric charge left, though. Oh, it's in... Okay. We're going to revert back to assembly. And we're going to put some more batteries on here. Because we almost have enough to transmit one. And then put some more back on. So what we're going to do is... It's going to be extra weight. But we're going to double our batteries here. And that should do it. Is there a way to see how much electric charge I have before I go to launch? Hmm. Okay. 
And launch. Oh, that was a janky launch. Okay, that's good. We're good now. Hmm. Okay, so this should work out much better. Um, well, we'll see how high these took us. They took us to, what, about 15 last time on the first stage? So we'll see how much weight, how much this extra weight really weighs us down in the grand scheme of things. I knew these liquid fuel tanks are a lot heavier, but the amount of thrust I get out of them is fantastic. Hmm. We're leaning ever so slightly. That's all right. There's a bit of a messy decouple there. Actually, we got about 16. It wasn't that big of a difference. Um, I would actually very much like to turn a bit that way. So I think I would prefer to go over the mountains so I can get the the shore and the mountains or the shore and the grasslands. I can't remember what I've gotten already. So I'm going to start turning. Ooh, wow, that's really a bad turn. This is killing me. Uh, this should be good. Oh my god, I'm real bad at this whole turning thing, aren't I? I want to level this out. There. So I get... Oh shit, I need to go up higher. Oh my god, if I don't hit 70, I'm going to be real frustrated. Okay, cool, I'm going to hit 70. Probably not long enough to get two crew reports, but that's fine. Okay, so what I need to do is cut this so I don't kill him when I start transmitting. We need to take a crew report as soon as we hit 70, so let's warp just a little bit. And that looks good. Get a crew report. I apparently already have gra grasslands. That's kind of a slap in the face. Okay, so I have gr grasslands, but I can get over this mountain, I do believe. Cut the throttle. Okay, so let's see what this is. Uh, still grasslands. Oh my god, if I don't hit any science here because of my... Mm. The bad thing about this is this is purely because I wanted to try and get two at once, so I didn't just go over the ocean. And I might get nothing because of it. Crap. Get the crew report. Oh my god, so close. Barely got that, so we're going to transmit this. And, oh, he's too, he's too low. Okay, so this is going to take a while to transmit, which is fine. Oh, uh, maybe. Okay. I don't know if I should have transmitted. I probably shouldn't have. I don't know if we should. Can you cancel transmission? If I turn that on, is it going to start draining from there first?
I don't know. I don't know how dangerous what I'm doing is, is the big question. Hmm. Because I want to decouple very soon. Come on, finish up, please. That was so terribly close. That was scary. Whew. Oh my god, what is this piece? What is going on here? That was scary close. Just barely, barely made that in time. Now we can launch the parachute. But we got that, didn't we? I don't know. I think we got... I'm pretty sure we got that science, so... That was sweet. And... This should kick in soon. Oh, about 500, I think, is when it kicks in. I think it's like 500 above sea level, so whatever that is. Oh, that was scary sounding. Cool. And we're just going to bring it down. There we go. 12.6. That should be an easy touch. Uh... Easy, easy drop. Fantastic. It should be. Okay, cool. Yeah, Jeb. Good guy, Jeb, eh? Look at him. Okay, I didn't think so. And I didn't think surface samples matter at all here either. This isn't going to be much of a groundbreaking discovery. Okay. And I can't get a crew report from here, can I? No. Cool. Let's recover. And I just need to do this same flight a couple more times in other directions. That'll let us get a couple more biomes. Um, we got 66 science total. So super excited about that. To get our next one, we need a total of 90 science. So I'll probably do those off camera. I want to thank you all for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and as always, have a great day.